Baton Rouge incoming commissioner of administration Jay Darden announced findings of a week's long analysis of the state's budget. Local 33's Talia Samalian joins us now live in studio with those findings. Talia. Fred, unfortunately, our budget situation is much worse than anyone previously thought. Right now, Darden says we're looking at a mid-year budget shortfall between $700 million and $750 million. It's happening in part because of falling oil prices, a drastic slump in sales taxes and corporate income taxes, and unexpectedly high Medicaid spending. Darden says our budget problem is too big to cut our way out of, a mess he says the Jindal administration caused. And now that Jindal is leaving, the new administration only has six months left in the fiscal year to plug this budget deficit. Darden says now is the time to stop kicking the can down the road. Our message to Louisianians today is this. We commit to you that we're ending the era of gimmicks and trickery. We're blowing away the smoke and breaking the mirrors regarding the state budget. We're committed to stabilizing the budget and structurally changing the way Louisiana handles its budgetary obligations to our citizens. There are more problems left after we balance this year's budget. Darden says there are even greater challenges in the year ahead, namely filling a gaping $1.9 billion hole in next year's budget. It appears that all options are on the table for saving our state's finances, including reductions in tax credits for businesses and raising gas or sales taxes. Live in the studio, I'm Talia Samalian, Local 33 News.